just gonna like say bye bye homes? Think it's that easy, you see? Hey YouTube, for those who follow us on a regular basis, you probably noticed we've been gone for a couple of uploads. Well, we're back. But what about us, is it? So where were you, Holmes? Just gonna like say bye bye, Holmes? Think it's that easy, is it? Whoa, calm down, bro. Now come on, really? Calm down, bro. The fact of the matter is, we were all pretty sick. So let me get this right, Holmes. Where were you, Wessie? So you just gonna like leave us, Holmes? What about us, Wessie? What about us, Holmes? We're talking about a family of seven that takes turns getting sick. <sighs> well, we're better now. Well, almost. Uh. But the cool thing is, we're back. Charlie Holmes, that's my kind of answer, Wesse. When you're done, we're done with you, Wesse. Let's go get it, Holmes. Let's get to vlogging, Wesse. Okay, so let me tell you everything that we just experienced. I would have filmed it all, but trust me, you really don't want to see what was going on. I mean, you don't want to see all the snippily, snobbity, hobbity, stubbity stuff that was happening. Trust me, you don't want to see all the snibbly, snobbity, hobbity stuff that was going on. Trust me, it's not filmable. It ain't filmable, trust me. It was not filmable, okay? So first of all, little Joseph, he ended up with early signs of pneumonia, so we got him in time. He was coughing up a storm, so that wasn't good at all. Poor little baby. And then you got Kaya and Serena, who ended up with upper respiratory infections and ear infections. Then you get Liana, Alicia, and Mama with flu-like symptoms, not to mention Alicia with ear infection. And then I end up with like sinusitis tepatitis. I don't know what it was called, but I was like the guy well through the whole thing. And right when I thought I was out, right when I thought I'd beat everybody's sicknesses, brother came down with it. It wasn't good. It wasn't good. I mean, one day, honestly, I slept. I went to bed at 5.30 p.m. and didn't wake up till 2.30 the next day. So that was pretty crazy. So this lasted forever, forever, ever. We could not even pick up a camera, much less vlog. So I'm glad you guys are still here with us. Thank you for your patience, but we're back. And so I thought I would just uh, give a quick vlog just to kind of let you know what's going on with us. We're still here, we're still alive. And thank you for all of your prayers for those of you that was aware of the situation. Okay now, so let's just get on with the message of the day. Let me get my vlog shirt on. Cool, vlog shirt on. Don't say you don't like the red vlog shirt. Y'all done seen me with this red vlog shirt a lot of times. You know what I'm saying? That's how I get my, my vlog groove on. You know what I'm saying? It look nerdy, don't it? So here's my question to you. Have you recently been hurt? Offended? Done wrong? Don't let anyone, anyone, take away who you are. You are awesome. Created by the creator of the universe himself. You have value. You have purpose. Somebody loves you, including myself. And you are far bigger than the stupidity that may come against you. Oh, by the way, if you think I'm trying to act like I got it all together, <laughs> you think I got it all together? Uh, no. I've had problems with all these things just like anybody else. Shh. By nature, I'm a human being. I'm a sinner. Now, admitting that doesn't exclude me from blame either. It just qualifies me to tell you that I get it. Now let's also make a whole different clarification on this too though. Do I mean to say that forgiveness entails being weak? Allowing folks to see you as a wimp? Giving them a pass to do more to you? Heck no! Like I said before, that's the beauty of it. Being able to actually forgive really is power. 
It's saying, I could hurt you. Like, maybe even really bad if I allow myself to respond to how I feel. But I choose to grant you peace, safety, a pass, all because I choose to. So because of my choice to forgive you, what I'm actually saying is, I'm gonna profit, spiritually that is, by the Creator. Because He's going to bless me for reacting in a way opposite of what I could. Who really has the power in this case? And truthfully, if you don't change, just by the natural law of reaping and sowing, you're eventually gonna get something very similar happen to you what you did to me. I'm just allowing you time to repent to give you a chance to change. It's just a natural law. I'm using the power of restraint to allow you time to repent. My friends, that's power. Now who's the better person now? Now obviously there are a million scenarios out there of different ways that someone can offend you where you need to forgive them. But don't confuse forgiveness with not letting someone do something to you again. You have a responsibility to defend yourself. Your person is not your own. You have a responsibility to defend yourself. You aren't your own. Your person, yourself, belongs to God. And as such, you were given yourself to take care of yourself in order to accomplish the purpose that you were created for. So let's get this straight. You are yourself a gift. So since yourself is a gift, you want to protect it, right? Right? I mean, you want to show gratefulness for it, right? Right? So really, please, protect yourself, if at all possible. Protecting yourself doesn't mean attacking. It doesn't mean going out and finding someone. It just means protecting yourself or defending yourself if they come at you, right? So the quick moral to my story is just remember, forgiving is not a weakness. Forgiving someone is actually a power. You're actually showing yourself stronger than that person. And in fact, you find yourself in the favor of God. You are not a victim. You are actually a victor. Hope this message helps. Love you all. Talk to you later. God bless. Bye. Hey guys, don't forget to give a thumbs up if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below and subscribe. And if you liked our new friend at the beginning of the video, then stay tuned because we're going to be officially announcing him in the next vlog. Thanks so much for watching. Love you guys. Bye.